Thank you. They decided they didn't want to tell you who I was. So I'm the siblings mom. Whoop whoop sibling squad. And today we're going to be making beaded animals as they just stated. So let's start off by telling them what we need. We need um, beads and tape. We need key rings and string. And you're also going to need scissors, of course, to cut the string. Now uh, we got this stuff from Walmart. So, but you can also go to the local, your local Dollar Tree. They have pretty much everything in there. And, okay, so, we're going to make a beaded lizard today. And so, this is what you're going to need. You're going to need 50 beads total. Bless you. Bless, Bless you. you. Bless you. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> Bless you. So, you're going to need 50 beads total. You're going to need 36 beads of one color. If you want to get fancy, you can mix them up. But these 36 beads is going to be for the body. Then you're going to need 12 beads of a different color that's different from the 36. And those are going to be like for the hands and feet. And then you're going to need two beads, just two beads, of another color. And those are going to be for the eyes. So, <laughs> so before we get started, I'm going to show you how to put on... On string. I'm going to show you how to put the ring on the string. So, what you're going to do is you're just going to take your string and you're going to lay, lay it on the table. You're going to lay the string, I mean the ring, on top of the string. Well, let me get closer so you can see. So, just put it through the, sh the little space. And then you take both of the strings and put it through the loop and then just pull it through and tie it. Now it's on there. Then you're going to take a piece of tape and you're going to tape down the key ring to your surface. So that way it won't be moving around and you'll be struggling trying to get the beads on. All right. 100 IQ thinking. It's mommy turn. So, are you guys ready? Yes. They already had their rings and string already together. So, first thing we're going to do is you're going to take one of the body colors, which is the one that you have the most of. You're going to take that and you're going to take one string. One string. You're going to put the bead on that one string, right? Yep. And then you're going to take the other string right and you're going to put it through the bead the bead and then you're going to pull the string until the bead gets all the way down to the, the to the beginning Mom, I think goes good. and it should be secured did everybody get it, I think I got it. you got it no. This is a task where you're going to have to follow directions very carefully. So if you have trouble following directions, this might be hard for you. But you can still do it. You see how I'm doing this? You put it on this. Then you take the other one and put it through. Then you pull it. This is how you're going to have to do the whole thing. Oh, uh, like may take you a whole year just like it did for me to defeat the Donkey Kong. All right, so because they don't have all night, you're going to take two more of those same colors and do the same thing, just two. You're going to put two on one side and take the other string and put it through both, both of the beads and do the same thing. Mommy, so pull like this? The same thing I just showed you. And we are going to do, and we're going to do the same thing for the next row, except, you remember those beads that I said only get two of but the same color? You're going to take one of those, put it on. Then you're going to take one of the beads that you're using for the body, put it on. Then you're going to throw other eye bead and put it on. 
Then you just put it through and pull it just like we did the first two rows. Oh, this is getting difficult now. It might take me a whole year again. So, after you did those three beads, yeah, you got it. After you did do those three beads, you're gonna take two more of your body beads and you're gonna do the same thing. Put two on, put one through. Put one on on one side, put the, on, on one side, well, put two on on one side, put the other string through. All right, so this part is gonna be a little tricky, but don't worry, I'm gonna help you get through it. So what, what the first thing you do is, you take two of your body beads, whatever color you have for your body, and put those on, on one string. Then you take three of those beads that I told you get 12 of one color, and take three of those and put those on one. And what you do is, you take the string, the same string this time. Don't use the other string like we was doing before. Use the same string. You take it and you put it through the last two. The last two. And then you pull it, the string through, and pull the beads all the way down. And now you've had, you made your, your call. So you do that on the left side and on the right side. So after you do that, after you do that, let me get my strings untied. You're gonna take two of your body beads, put them on one side, and we back to how we're doing it normally. You take the other string, put it through. See, I got a string piece on each side, and pull it down to the end. Now we're gonna take three of our body beads, three this time, and the next row is gonna be four. So let's do three, and then after we tie the three down, then we do four. All right, so after you did the three and the four, now you're gonna do three of your body beads. You're gonna take those and put those on. Remember, always on that one side. Then you're gonna take the other string and put it through. It can be a little tricky at first, but once you get the hang of it, It'll be bad. Okay. Now, after you do the three, it's time to make those legs again. The paws, you do it the same exact way. So I'll just take, instead of taking two of my body beads, I'll take oops, got one, two of my 12, put those on first, then take three of my body beads, put those, put those on, then I'm still going to put this one string through the last two, and then I'm going to put it all the way through. And as you can see, my leg on this side is different than the one on this side. Yes, son? Yeah, wait till we get to the end so we can show everybody. All right, so we're almost there. We're almost there. Hang in there. Hang in there. So now that we got both paws on, both back paws on, we're going to take two of our body colors, put those on. Same way, put the other string through, pull through. And then after this, now it's coming up to the tail part. So you can either, if you have more beads, you could either do two or you could just do one. So I think I'm just gonna do one, just so I can have a really long tail. You can still have a long tail with two, but I didn't pull out enough. So, just gonna put one bead on, 
then put the string through. CJ has finished his off camera, so that's why he can't sit still. Alright, so guys, let's show off our finished product. This is mine. My little lizard. I'm going to name him Rod. This is Imani's. Oh, look how nice and colorful. Nice. Look at that tail. You can always mix it up. And here we have CJ's. Look at that. I'm going to name my that. cutie. So as you can see, it can be however you like. It can be all one color. It can be more colors. You can have a different color for every bead. It doesn't matter. I was just trying to show you the easiest way to do it. Try to keep everything more simple. So just want to thank you guys for stopping by to our channel. And we're going to say we'll see you in the next video, whatever that may be. If you have any comments, leave them down below. And we're going to say it's Sibling Squad out.